My name is Robert Hampson. I'm a professor of modern literature in the English department at Royal Holloway, and I'm a, the founder and program director for the Runnymede International Literary Festival. I think literary festivals do manifold different kinds of good. They allow readers to meet authors that they like and then they allow authors to meet their readers, which is always a, a valuable thing to do and, and can be a very heartening thing to do. But they also spread the word about writing and about its place in all our lives in a very obvious and happy-making way. There's absolutely nothing to be said against them and everything to be said for them, I think. And I think particularly in a college like ours, which has a very developed sense of what it is to be a creative writer at undergraduate and at graduate level. It makes especially good sense to have such a thing. The festival started about eight or nine years ago when I was approached by an organisation called The South, which is a community arts organisation based in Brighton. They'd been approached by Runnymede Borough Council. Uh, the council was interested in raising its profile through having some kind of literary events, literary festival. The initial idea was to have two components. One component would be to have poets, novelists, um, who had a national or international reputation and bring them into Runnymede. And the other, part of the, the other part of the conception for the festival was that we would do events with the community, do events in schools, in youth clubs, with various different groups in the community. And we had a lot of backing from the college, a lot of backing from Runnymede Borough Council, and funding from a range of sources. It was a lot of fun for a start. I think um, we hadn't had that sort of opportunity before uh, to really organise anything much and it was really good fun when um, it all came together, sort of, uh, everyone enjoying it and um, it gave me a bit of experience with organising which is something I'm not perhaps very good at and as well as that I, I did enjoy reading my piece as well, I think it's something that um, when you're a writer, <laughs> as I use the term loosely, uh, you don't have an opportunity to do a lot in front of a receptive audience that isn't just your very sort of close friends or family um, and so that's, that's quite an invaluable experience. It's always nice to uh, hear uh, an author read their own book and in this case uh, the backdrop of Treasure Island which is one of the favourite books I can remember my dad reading to me as a, a 10, 11 year old kid uh, so it was uh, irresistible really the opportunity to come and uh, hear a part of this book for myself. It seems like it's such a great place, it's a really good, good idea to encourage students from all different disciplines to interact and to participate in these kind of events. It's a really good opportunity for our MA students to do their first reading in a really nice supportive environment. Um, it's an opportunity for people to hear what's going on in our MA um, and the, the kind of work, the kind of range um, of work that our students are coming up with. And um, it's a really nice, you know, vibrant evening. The Running Need Literature Festival is a diverse and interesting time of year where um, perhaps the students of Royal Holloway have easier access to some uh, li literary events that they otherwise wouldn't have and they, um, yeah, see and see, see, they can see and hear things um, that can be very informational and interesting. <laughs>